Good morning everyone. We are currently in Chimenez uh, to get to John at G5 Custom to get my high top to look at and hopefully fix a little something or at least have a second view on it. But this morning before I go see him, um, Lauren from Lovely Arvron <laughs> texted me last night and it was like, can you send me a picture of your engine? Uh, just to make sure it doesn't leak again or that it can have just a better look we're gonna do this for the next month before I go on my traveling trip just to have a better understanding and make sure so I'm gonna remove everything in the front uh, open the dog house and see you know, hopefully we don't leak but see if we are leaking Oh no guys, we are leaking. <laughs> Gonna send a picture to Lauren. Um, I still didn't put the product that you told me to put uh, because uh, I, my plan was to go do my oil change this week and to put that product after. Kitty, stay there. <laughs> Alright, picture. All right, the good part about doing that a couple of times, it uh, doesn't take me that much time. <laughs> All right, so I sent a picture to Lauren. We're going to wait on this. Uh, I'm going to clean the van and dump the garbage. And we're going to go see Joan for our second problem, <laughs> the high top. These days, to be quite honest, guy, I work with Paul. I have a list of... Oh. I have a list of a couple uh, little issue and little things that I need to do and it's just go one by one. <laughs> Not more than that. Uh, he said, Lauren, yes, that's what I was worried about. Let's get the oil additive, which is the thing that I uh, didn't put yet, and see uh, if it's going to slow it down for the next week or so. And if not, we will need to get it all done and do the head gasket. Sad face for me him too. Sad face for me too. So currently, yeah, that's the that's the only corner that I think I have a leak in this one. Awesome. Yeah. And it's, it leaks when it's sitting, is that right? Yeah. Not when you're driving? Like it, when it's been sitting longer? Yeah, that's where I see it, but okay. yeah. And it go all along my, inside my columns here. Oh, like okay. I have water dripping. And a trip to, I think, my floor of my van itself. If it's leaking in here, yep. like I assume, is this all accessible on the inside? Yeah, you can see it, but okay, it's perfect. really hard, but yeah, you can see it. Good. I mean, this, yeah. The silicone is not my first choice of what I would seal anything with. Oh, okay. But what I can do, I'm going to put some soapy water on it and then we're going to put some compressed air on the inside. Okay, sounds good. So I just empty everything here. This is what fit on top there. A couple of can of maple syrup in this too. So a lot can fit into this cover here. So what John's gonna do for first test, he said that he's gonna put some soapy water and put some air pressure and see um, see what he can see. <laughs> we go from there. I told him no pressure. I know, I know. <laughs> I know it's got a lot of pressure because they tried three times and didn't work. But really, 
what I'm here for is just for another eyes on everything. And yeah, hopefully, hopefully you can find a solution. product name that he told me I always forget <laughs> uh, it put a product it was not trail wood what they actually put they put the silicone a clear silicone which is over the time might cause some problem because of the Sun and everything so I'm gonna monitor the little section that he fixed uh, we're gonna go from there and maybe eventually we're gonna do a bigger section or next winter um, if uh, the little repair that they done before with the high top uh, it's not you know it 
it's not good enough. But uh, yeah, it was nice to do this simple little test with soap and water. A lot of people were telling me to put some soap in water, but it's hard by yourself when you're outside and you know, um, and it took like really a specific little bit of air in specific place to find where the water was coming from. Uh, so happy, simple, little quick. So maybe, maybe I can half cross this problem. We still have to test. Uh, I have to look the weather. Tiny little bit of rain later on today, I think, but not enough to really do a test like you may have known. <laughs> uh, to really do a test, you need to have like a good rain. Uh, I can go in a couple of days, uh, next week maybe, um, go to the car wash and really just put water in that direction and see what we have. If it doesn't rain earlier, but let's see. So yeah, barely any rain today. Oh, Wednesday morning. Wednesday morning, guys. That's where we're going to do the big test. 10 millimeters of rain seem uh, to be to be the day test. <laughs> After that, it will be sunny, 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 sunny. So we have a couple of days to make sure everything's dry. You told me anyway that it will dry in an hour or not even half an hour. So we good. And yeah, so problem half check. I still have to do my oil change and that's going to be the next part of the video. I think it's going to be tomorrow though. <laughs> Should be, should be up here. Yeah. They see a leak. Oh no. All right, so I texted Laura and he told me to keep going with our plan, which is to put this big thing into the oil that's gonna kind of like seal a little bit hopefully help and I'm gonna clean the engine too as well so we have a better idea of what's gonna be leaking and in a week or so I'm gonna open the dug house again and see where we are where we at so all right let's do that that I can do for cleaning the cleaning part is just so we have a better idea if it's still leaking or not um, so I think I've done everything I'm gonna put the doghouse back on I'm getting an expert about, <laughs> about that now <laughs> it's been a couple times it's just a very small space to work with All right, so I think guys, I'm gonna see you tomorrow morning. Uh, it's supposed to rain, so we're gonna have the final result if we have some water coming here, if, uh, if everything is all right. Um, it rained a little bit last night and it was dry, but 
I need we need a good raining. I think tomorrow morning is gonna be the time. So uh, that's gonna be a three day making video, which is not that usual. So I'm gonna see you tomorrow. As I was editing uh, my video this morning, I realized whew, I forgot to update you guys. <laughs> the most important part. Um, so we had a little bit of rain. Uh, no leak. No leak. No leak. <laughs> uh, I put a little bit more cedar just to make sure. And yeah, hopefully uh, that's all gonna be good for for the high top. Hopefully I'm not gonna make any more video about leaky high top. I am tired of it. Let's put that behind. But yeah, so far, so far everything is good. So. I hope you enjoy guys. Uh, don't forget to subscribe if you're not already and I'm gonna leave you obviously with Miss Kitty. With Miss Kitty who also just woke up. Hi baby. It's kissing time. Like no mom. I just woke up. <laughs> you like me in the morning. <laughs> you need a little bit of time. Alright guys. We'll see you in the next one. Mm -hmm.